Darksiders 2 is less than two weeks away, and while we've taken you on a tour of the game's vast world, today we're going to unveil a brand new mode that unlocks during Death's epic journey. Today, we take a look at the Crucible mode. Unlocked after Death has been deemed worthy, Crucible mode is an in-game, arena-based challenge where Death must take on waves of enemies, testing his abilities at the risk of great reward. Each wave of enemies consists of creatures that Death has recently battled in his journey, including mini-bosses and at least one full boss. After every five waves, Death is given a choice by Cargon, master of the Crucible and the only man who has ever managed to best the arena's great challenge. That choice? Accept a gift and walk away, or commit to five more battles. These rewards are randomly generated, but they're based on the difficulty of the challenge, and some items and equipment are only available in the Crucible, potentially making this investment well worth the effort. Better yet, you will still earn experience points for your combat. By the end of Darksiders 2, Death will have up to 100 waves of enemies to challenge and defeat before Cargon deems him a champion. As vast and expansive as this game is, only the best players will be able to overcome this incredible task. For more on Darksiders 2, including our full review of the game, stay tuned to IGN.com. Thank <laughs> you.